Hey everybody, I just wanted to put this video out today. Um, I've been having all kind of headaches with my Battlefield 4. Uh, and what I've been running into is the same problem a lot of people have been having for a long time. The DirectX error. It's a crash. It causes your game to crash. Uh, you'll get It'll just freeze up and then all of a sudden it'll just crash out on you. I've, I've had this problem all day long. Now I'm running the Windows 10 preview. Uh, this uh, may not be happening for a lot of people anymore, but uh, I'm set this up so I could be prepared whenever Windows 10 comes out at the end of the month. Uh, I want to uh, post this just so everybody can kind of know exactly what I did to solve this problem, and it worked. The only thing that has worked. I've been all over the internet today. I've searched everywhere. I've come up with dozens of forum posts, all kinds of YouTube videos. This works. Here's what I did. Go into your documents. Go into your Battlefield 4. You'll pull up that, go into the settings, and then go into this file right here. It's a profile setting file is what it is. It's like an INI sort of file. Uh, go down to WordPad and open this file. Now what you're looking for in WordPad is a line called Get Render Overall Graphic Quality. On mine, before I changed it, it said 4. Uh, a lot of people say that it there says 5. It may say whatever for you, I don't know. The trick to it is to edit that last number, change it from whatever it is to 0. I had mine, like I said, set it 4, it said, now it's set at 0. Save that and then exit out. This will fix your problem with the DirectX crashes. Such a simple solution. Uh, apparently nobody had the answer anywhere and I had to dig and dig and dig and dig and finally found the solution. So I don't want everybody else to have to go through this crap that I had to go through today. Uh, it crashed on me every single game for about six hours. I could not figure out what was going on. I changed this I've been playing for well over an hour, hour and a half now, not a single crash. Multiple games uh, over and over and over. So I'm absolutely positive this solved my problem. So hopefully this will solve it for you. Uh, I appreciate you guys watching the video. Um, like, sub if you want to. It's not a, not an obligation. I appreciate it very much uh, regardless. Thanks for watching and share this with everybody you can. Peace.